The more personal, the more creative. Welcome to the Dream Factory. My name is Vector and I'm back again. And today I have a story card. So let's get into it. When we're creating content, it is easy to get lost in trying to appeal to the masses, trying to create what's popular and trying to follow trends. But in doing so, we can lose the authenticity that made our work truly unique and meaningful. Being personal in your work means sharing your unique perspectives, experiences and emotions. Even if it may ruffle some feathers or be a bit embarrassing, it means being honest and vulnerable, but also respectful. When we share personal stories and experiences, we allow people to connect with us on a deeper level. It gives them a glimpse into who we are as a person and what we stand for. This creates a sense of trust and authenticity that can lead to long lasting relationships with the people who view your content. So the challenge for you this week is to create something personal that represents who you are and what you stand for. Share it with your audience and see how it resonates with them. Being personal does not make you weak. It's one of the superpowers within creativity. Remember that. Yo, thank you for tuning into the Dream Factory. The fact that you made it this far, you might as well like and subscribe. In fact, if you're looking to take your creative growth to the next level, then you need to check out the Dream Factory web app. It's a place where you can track your creative growth over time and also connect with like-minded people who share our passion for learning, motivation and creativity. So, what are you waiting for? Oh, you want to watch another one of my videos? And remember, dreams don't work unless you do.